good afternoon guys and welcome back to nancy explores it's been a minute but i am here to fill your screens update you on my skincare and i'll do a little bit of makeup basically if you have seen a previous uh skincare slash makeup videos you have been you know with me so far through this journey i'm still on the journey still trying to figure out what to use for my skin what works best for my skin and hopefully after the lockdown i could go see an dermatologist and basically fix it so as you can see from last time since last time my skin has a little bit improved just a little bit uh, to tell you the truth basically i had a, a little breakout uh with my skin and uh th there was a few spots that came out especially in this area here so basically this is the area where i suffer the most that's where most of the spots uh, come out and uh, just ruin my life but for the past week uh, things have come down a little bit as you can see so basically right now there's no more major spots only dark only dark spots basically see on these cars do not mind this one i have no idea where it comes from there, there was one that was coming out as well here under my brow but it's fine now i have been using a toothpaste <laughs> to basically kill it it's working so far so for two days i've been using toothpaste here because this one here was like the president of it all like it was so huge it was big it was hurting me as well it was just like it was like there was some creature inside of it so i decided to use uh, a really old um tactic that a lot of people use so basically to use toothpaste on it uh, overnight i will put it before bed sleep with it wake up and uh the pain will reduce a little bit and uh, the spot will stop growing that's what i've been using so far on that one but overall my skin has been looking good and fresh mainly because of the sun thank god the sun is coming out so i've been feeding my skin with vitamin d i've seen a lot of improvement so let me show you again what uh what i've been using so far what has been working for me and uh and yeah so today's so yeah today's video is just gonna be a short one i'll try to do a short one to show you you know the product and uh go straight to my makeup and hair i'll do a little bit of hair though and uh just to show you what uh, i'm doing today i hope you are safe i hope you are healthy you're keeping healthy i hope you're taking your vitamin c's and d's i take them every day take your um, take your organic teas take your organic product and uh and yeah just you know do your most do your most just keep healthy and this lockdown hopefully will be soon over i'm hearing other countries getting out of it <laughs> soon we'll get out of it soon france germany belgium so yeah fingers crossed for us here in london anyway let's get down to business okay guys so let's dig into what i've been using so far in the morning and the evening before bed i showed you last time that the product that i use to wash my face is this one here you can still see it it's la roche posée which is a very very good product a french product that uh that i'm stuck to now i will not change again and I promised you that I'll stick to one product and that's what I'm doing. So this gel, I use it every morning and every night, you know, you know, just to clean my skin. And then I go on to use my toners. Yes, I said toners because I have two. The first one that I use only in the morning is this one here. La Roche Posay uh, Toner Astrogent Lotion, Micro Exfoliant and Anti Blackhead. So this one here helps me clear my skin, make it more smoother and more exfoliant and cleaner basically. It helps me with the uh, dark spots. I've been seeing results so I'm sticking to it. And at night before I apply my serum, I use this one here. Can you see it? So again, this is a French product from uh, Christian Lenard. You can see the name on top there. 
uh, I have a friend, no, my sister's friend said, uh, recommended this for me. She used to have a lot of acne problems as well. And uh, she says that she doesn't use anything else except for this one here. So it's called Eau Aromatisée de Rose, which means rose aromatized water. So it's made of roses and it smells really good. It really refreshes my skin. It leaves a really, you know, aromatized uh, order from roses i've been using this at nine after using my uh my foaming gel and i'm happy with it yes so these are the products that i've been using straight after uh washing my skin oh guys sorry i forgot to let you know what i use uh to wash my face with i always i always use my hands obviously like everyone else but then i came around this brush here I know it's really small <laughs> that's my mistake because I saw it at night <laughs> and someone else has recommended it to me you know to make sure that you know I was cleaning my face properly and uh, it was proper going deep and taking out all those impurities from your skin the impurities that you accumulated during the day but I went online and I saw this yeah and I didn't read the title properly I didn't I didn't I didn't read the full title so this is a mini I thought I was buying the normal size one but this is a mini this is a portable one that you can take with you on holiday or whatever so basically you can take it with you everywhere so I I bought this i've been using this two or three times a week as well to wash my face i don't want it to be too rough on my skin i haven't been using it every day so i've been using this to wash my face two or three times a week and uh and it feels great it feels great it, it, it actually washes your face deeply and uh and and i'm happy with it i have no complaints so basically this is where this uh this little you know this little surface here this is where you turn it on and there's vibration that comes with it so when you use it you can feel it vibrating over your skin it's really really good i recommend it careful with the title though because there are mini sizes and normal sizes this one is mini so it's fine though this, these are what uh basically i use every day washing my skin after all that i apply my serum if you remember from my last video i talked about my serum i used to use i, I was waiting for a serum to come because the one that i used to use ran out but i came across this one i did my research yeah for acne acne pro skin and uh an oily skin and i came across this It's called Guino and it's French again. I really love my French products because they're actually more effective than anything else. It's called Guino, it's from the Guino Institute in Paris. The serum is called Creme Serum Acne Logic Cream Serum Serum Creme Sebo Regulateur Visage Peau Grasse à Tendance Acneique, which means Sebum Control Cream Serum face acne prone oily skin so when i was oily skin and i saw acne i was like yep that's me so i went on and bought it it was it was affordable it was like 30 pound or 35 pound and it came really quickly and that's what i've been using every morning and every night before going to bed and then i use my enemies cream during the day again after applying my serum and during the night again if you remember what i said last time i was waiting for my night mask or my sleeping mask to come so that i could start using it recommended by a good friend of mine which uh, has been working beautifully on her so this is the sleeping mask that i've been using fresh the company that make it called fresh the name of the product is fresh rose deep hydration sleeping mask replenishes and logs hydration i've been using it and i'm really really happy with it i think this also you know contributed to the improvement of my skin over the past two weeks it actually relaxes you at night and it smells so good it's also made of roses just like this product that i showed you so i think roses are something that we are you know that we are underrating 
I, I think product roses work really well with your skin so i've been you know i've been i've become a little obsessed with every product that's made that that's made of roses because they are so oh boy they're so good they're just good so yeah guys these are the products that i've been using for the past two weeks and this is the result so far again i still have my little my little dark spots as you can see and scars i still have scars but i also think that the reason why i have so many spots and you know scars around in this area is because of in growth i think i have a problem with my hormones yeah i think my hormones are unbalanced and again that's the reason why i really need to see a dermatologist i saw a few people on youtube talking about the same problem how they always have like you know how they have a lot of scars in this area so and uh, they they did the research and they found out that it was you know it, it was because of their hormones uh, or some other type of of skin problem so i have a problem with ingrown hair and uh, they probably get stuck inside and create spots and uh, and yeah that's one of the main reasons and uh, hopefully i will see a dermatologist soon and it will confirm what i am saying and this one here forget about it <laughs> it will go soon i know it it doesn't hurt anymore thank god now it's fine now i can get rid of it and uh continue my skin care journey so yeah so far this is it guys this is what i've been using it works for me let's just cross our fingers to hope that it will continue to make you know to bring good results on my skin and uh, and be the answers to my prayers don't worry about my nails we in quarantine guys we can't do our nails you know we can't go out and do our nails so yeah i'm just waiting for this to like to come off that was so hard to come off yeah my sister told me to use acetone some kind of nail you know nail varnish remover and i tried it it hasn't worked yet but i'm just waiting for i'm just waiting for them to you know to just snap so i can get rid of them so yeah don't worry about them and please ignore <laughs> ignore them completely i know they look disgusting and weird but yeah hard times all right guys finish i finished with my skincare uh recap you know my skincare update i decided i'll be doing that every two weeks now and tell you about how my skin you know about my skin and how you know how the how the journey has been so far and uh how my skin has been improving or not so yeah this is what i've been doing every two weeks now i'm gonna do a little bit of makeup with uh, a few palettes that I bought from uh, Juvia's Place which is now one of my favorite brands to buy I buy my foundations there, I buy my concealers there I bought a few palettes listen, they're just perfect perfect. I just love their products they, they, they are made for me so yeah, I bought a few palettes and I'm gonna use one of them it's, gonna be, it's not gonna be too dramatic it's just gonna be a nice pretty look that i'm gonna do for you and i uh, hope you like it so guys i will write down all the products that i've talked about for my skin in the description and uh, i'll also link them so you can you know go shopping and uh, and explore by yourself and yeah so thank you guys for listening to my rambling <laughs> i told you just bear with me keep up with me when it comes to my skin and uh, will we get there i hope to see you to my next video i hope to see your comments your suggestions or what she do or what i shouldn't do and uh, i hope to see you yeah i hope to see you next time thank you guys for tuning in and let's get down to the makeup